Hey, human Latios, it's this is Latios Azura, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Shuffle. So, let's begin. So, last time we took on Superior and the Magikarp and Gyarados Pikachu, or costume Pikachus. This time, we have the Unova Cap Pikachu. I know, like, who saw this coming after the Hoenn and, uh, and, um, Sinnoh ones? Seriously. Let's go hit this thing on. Okay, so I used an optimized team with Mega Beedrill, so let's just see what we can do. Okay, we got the Unova starters. Big surprise. So, alright, we're getting the Mega Evolution off right now, which is really nice. Ooh, nice Mega Effect here. Let's do this. And, okay, we're not going to one-shot this thing, but we still can, I think, do okay. I think. Let's do this. Let's get rid of this stuff, I guess. I don't know. No, that was a mistake. Oops. All right, let's do this. Get a nice little risk-taker boost in there. So now I think we can finish this thing off with uh, this. So we're going to have seven moves remaining. Maybe we can get a decent catch rate, although knowing Pokemon in Pokemon Shuffle as of late, that does not seem very likely. But hey, you never know, do you? You never really know. So! Base 4%. Yes, that is such a high catch rate. Up to 1 in 4. 25%. Come on, Pikachu. Do you want to stay in this ball? 1 in 4... You are breaking out. Okay, Pikachu, thanks for that. You're gonna give me a super catch power, though, all the way up to 99%. Okay, you know what? I gotta go for this just to see if Pikachu wants to be worse than Steelix. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna break out, though. Okay, no, it's staying in. Pikachu is definitely not... That would have been one-upping Steelix, I will say that, though. I probably shouldn't have graded bought it because it was a pretty easy stage, but there we go, it has an attack power of 60, the electric typing, the ability barrier shot. With that, we have captured the Unova Cap Pikachu. In fact, I'm pretty sure we actually also S ranked, enough that it even really matters. Yeah, there's an S rank. We also have Lux Rays here in a, um, I guess, a PSB farmable stage, which is from, it's normally an expert stage, but I guess if you didn't unlock that yet, this is your opportunity to go catch yourself a Lux Ray, or if you're using Lux Ray and you want to get it uh, stronger. I guess now is your chance to do that. Latios is back for its escalation battle, so go catch yourself a Latios if you haven't gotten it already, because it's pretty good. Uh, level 50, you can get the Mega Evol well, the Mega Stone for it, although I feel like it's outclassed by a lot of other Megas, especially because there are fewer and fewer Dragon types uh, being released these days, although I feel like the Django line will be coming probably sometime in the foreseeable future, and possibly Guzzlord might be Dragon type in this game. It all depends. So, hey, you know, go get that. Um, Gyarados, Thunderous, Arceus still here. If you didn't get the Magikarp of Gyarados costume Pikachus, they're still in the Safari. And we also have this competition returning, which seems to be the shiny Mega Gyarados. They seem to really be uh, pushing the whole shiny Gyarados thing this week, with the shiny Mega Gyarados competition returning. And... It is a type-restricted competition, so only electric and normal-type Pokemon can be used. So, wait a minute. You can only use Ampharos, Autono, and Kangaskhan, and Lopunny for the Mega Evolution? You can't use Magnetric. Oh, that sucks. Well, I guess those of you who did, um, I guess, Mega Speed Up your, um, your Ampharos, I mean, this is your time to shine, I suppose. So, yeah. I'm not going to put any items into this thing because I have no idea how it's going to go, so let's see what we can do. Alright, let's try to get ourselves a high score. We only have seven moves, seriously. GS, what is up with this? And I guess this is probably a good time to, I guess, use your shiny Gyarados costume Pikachu if you have it. Although, you probably should have it by now, I would think. Okay, I didn't think to use that, did I? Alright, this is going to go pretty horribly, isn't it? I didn't train mine anyway, so I don't know how much help it would really... Oh, that's the disruption. Well, asked and answered. Okay, you know what? Let's do... 
Let's do this. I'm not getting combos at all. Okay, this is about to be the most pitiful competition uh, entry, I think, ever. Can we at least get 5,000? Alright, at least we got 5,000. So, you know, there's that. Are you kidding me? Did that seriously just happen? Oh my goodness, that was actually pitiful. Truly, truly pitiful. So, long story short, bring your shiny Gyarados Pikachu here. Even if you didn't train it, it's gonna be weak, but it's probably better than nothing. So, you know what, I'm gonna try this again. I'm gonna do it itemless, but I'm gonna try it with the uh, shiny Gyarados Pikachu. And let's see what... Let's see how that goes. So, goodbye Magnezone. And in all fairness, uh, since you can't use Gyarados... Well, shiny Gyarados, unfortunately, which... I feel like you being able to use shiny Gyarados would have definitely made sense for this competition. I don't know why they made it... So you can't, although I guess because, I guess they could have made an exception for it, but, eh, whatever. Okay, so Pikachu is going to come through for us this time, on the in the beginning, so that's kind of nice. Which we're going to need, okay, so already we have, we're doing better than last time on the first turn. So, that's kind of nice, I suppose. Alright, so let's... Let's do... I have no idea, to be honest, what to do right here. I am going to do... This. I don't know why I did that. But, whatever. Can we at least get 10k? You had to get rid of the Pikachu. Okay, you know what, let's do... Let's do this. Pikachu's not coming through. My goal is still to get 10k. I think we can do it this time. Although, I guess that's kind of the Gyarados, since Gyarados seems to be getting more points for us than we're getting. So close to the uh, 10k right there, I will say. Alright, let's... We can get the Mega Evolution, I just don't think it'll do us any real good. At least it'll combo into Zekrom here. So there's the Mega Evolution, which is kind of surprising to me, to be honest. So hey, we're getting a Mega Effect off, so that's that's kind of good, I guess. Oh hey, I mean... Well, hey, this is definitely better than last time, I will say that. This is definitely an improvement. Okay, let's do this. Pikachu is not going to come through for us, but we are going to get enough combo stuff in order to get ourselves 16,000, which is triple what we had last time. So I'm going to say, yeah, bring in this Pikachu definitely works out for you. I do recommend it, even if you haven't trained it at all like me. So probably, I guess, if you use some items, you'll do even better. Although I can't imagine the scores are going to be astronomically high, considering this is a 7-move stage. That said, good luck to everyone who is doing this stuff. Good luck to catch them, to everyone trying to catch that uh, Unova Cat Pikachu. So thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time when we have some more stuff to do here in Pokemon Shuffle. Goodbye.